hey, so we've announced where we're going, we've announced Costa Rica, but um, it would be unfair to you guys if we just showed you the, or not showed you, but rather just talked about the really exciting things and the things that are so amazing and oh, so much fun. I think we'd be doing a disservice if we didn't get real and raw and talk about the uncomfortable things about picking up and selling it all and leaving your family, taking your family to a other country. So um, I just wanted to uh, do a short and sweet video and uh, talk about some feelings that um, we uh, went through and uh, feelings that we're still going through um, in regards to our move. So, I mean, look, there are a lot of people in our lives that um, we are going to miss tremendously and it hurts and it's uncomfortable and it's scary and we cry. I mean, I cry. Um, and some might ask, why are you doing this then? Why are you doing this then if it's so painful? Well, the truth of the matter is, I think I would regret and it would hurt more and I'd be more uncomfortable and scared if I actually stayed here in my comfort zone. So I'm reading a book. It's called You Squared by Price Pritchett. And I highly suggest anyone that is interested in making a quantum leap, check out this book. Quantum leaps you cannot explain. We think that when we want to achieve something great, we have to go through steps beforehand to get to that quantum leap. Truth is, no, you have no idea how you're going to do it. You don't worry about the how, but you act from the place as though you have already achieved it. All the success that you want. So we are going to miss everyone and it pains us. But what I also refuse to do now is be quiet about my excitement, our excitement, and feel less shame. Because I sometimes don't talk about Costa Rica because I don't want to make people feel uncomfortable. I don't want to talk about how excited we are. But it stops today and it stops now because let's face it those people that are struggling have a hard time with what they're doing right now don't know what they want to do don't have the clarity or the strong enough vision um when 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 news like this is presented to them it's like well, why would you do that? Like, what do you mean? And they, and they, they just can't wrap their heads around it. And I mean, no one's at fault. I just want to talk about this kind of stuff because yes, you'll see us moving. You'll see this, you'll see that. You'll see us at the storage unit. You'll see like the kids talking about Costa Rica. You'll, but I mean, guys, there's a lot of emotional stuff happening behind the scenes. Um, and, and, and also the truth, too, is there's a lot of tests along the way and there's a lot of chaos. And that's how I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling so chaotic. <sighs> but going back to that book, You Squared, when you are going through a quantum leap, there is chaos and disorder and sometimes you might stop and hit the terror barrier which is that wall and it'll make you stop nah it's getting too hard it's getting really uncomfortable it's getting too hard no it's when you gotta push harder push through that wall 
That's it. Just know that, yes, we are super excited to go. But also know that we are humans and we're emotionally going through a huge change. And I just want to remind you that we are just like you. We are just like you. We are ordinary people doing extraordinary things. And we are made for more. My family is made for more. And you are made for more. You are made for more. A lot of us attach ourselves to companies. A lot of us attach ourselves to careers and our titles. Attach yourself to a purpose. Attach yourself to your vision, the greater good. Always with so much peace, love, and light. Till next time.